Welcome guys, welcome to today's WordPress tip on security, how to make your administration a mission link. So your link, whatever your website is, www dot blah blah dot net slash wp is the normal well we're going to help you to be able to change that so you can stop automatic bots and bots and hackers from knowing your administration login area for wordpress once that is done that clears that problem up it helps uh, create a more uh, secure solution just that little bit helps um, prevent um, example like leaving your keys in the door so by having um, yeah by having the uh, web link not hidden for the administration area of WordPress is like nearly leaving your one of your keys in the door and saying Hello, Mr. Burglar. I'm giving you the opportunity to open one of the keys of my door. Maybe not the whole of your doors, but at least one of your doors. So this is how, how to prevent that uh, from happening in the technology world of WordPress. So we're going to go ahead and show you a simple solution. As you can see, that we've got iThemed Security opened up. That is the method we're going to use today and why we say that is because it, it is uh, multifunctional, has many benefits besides what I'm showing you today. But for today, we're only going to show you how to um, hide your uh, admin login, but it has so much more benefits and we'll go into that deeply later. But you can also search on YouTube or other uh, websites through our Google search engine and find other uses for iTheme security. So what we're going to show you is two other opportunities uh, and options that you can take. So if you just want a straight out plugin, you can choose from WPS Hide Login. You can search that in your login of your back end of your WordPress or you can search for that in Google and it should come up so that you can add that to your WordPress if you choose. And you can see that they've got a quite a number of your views, 4.8 out of 5 stars, which is quite good. Uh, but be mindful, always keep on when it's been updated. Is it been updated regularly? And also it's good to go through the feedback, but when was it last updated is very important too. So you have another opportunity, another option is to use the Protect Your Admin, Lock Down Your WordPress. Now these two uh, uh, WordPress plugins uh, focus in on the uh, hiding the, the admin part and the administration part of your links in your domain from uh, administration uh, security attacks. But I highly recommend, and this is the option we take, is to use iThemes. Why we decided to use that over these two as an option is because less WordPress plugins, the better and this way you're cutting out having too many uh, WordPress plugins but it's up to you so I give you this option to take but for today's example we're going to show uh, simply go down load uh, iTheme security then you want to head over to the security settings and then you want to head across to advance the advance area on the uh, right hand top of the menu of iTheme security and then you'll see here simply hide my back end you'll go here 
to configure the settings here. And for this example sake, we won't show you because we have our hidden entries there. Highly recommend or always keep that secure away from harm's way. So you'll click on here, configure the settings. It's very step-by-step -step friendly how to set that up to change your login. So instead of having the WP admin, you can change it to whatever. Something that you'll remember, something that, that uh, is not common would be a great um, idea to come up with. A word that um, you can always remember but others cannot remember or would not be common. Okay, so I hope this helps. I hope this uh, gives you a little bit of uh, entail into the uh, security of WordPress. It's a very complex, um, it can become a very complex uh, um, tunnel to go down with WordPress security, but it can also be fun and exciting. And here at, uh, at Brian Bolsh uh, YouTube, we try to hone down and make it more effortless for you, make it more fun, make it more simple and exciting. So if you have any feedback, feedback please leave it down in the comments and we'll more than appreciate positive and negative feedbacks but please keep in mind no profanity and only constructive feedback thank you very much for your day have a great day